We're hoping the Texans will be champs as well, and they've got a recipe for tailgating success out there in the patio for us. Yeah, can you see the smoke just kind of oozing on over? George, Victor, they are doing it up this morning. We are tailgating in style. Yes, we are. They're with Pit Maker, and it smells great. And George, tell us about this thing that you guys have designed. It's a, it's a six shooter. That's a, that's a, that's a barbecue grill. It's actually a smoker. We have sausage and brisket going on for us in the morning. And this is our offense trailer here. We have our defense trailer covered over there with the uh, Texican cookers. And as you can see, we've what thrown down. This? Gotta get your offense quick on the field. These are football brownies. We uh, have our tiger jerky is branded right back there, if you can see that. Oh, wow, look at the branding. <laughs> and we have you know, some cut fruit, just some good finger foods to get you quick out there until the, the meat comes off the pit. Wow, you and, guys and, do can it Tell well. us about this thing. Who did you make this for? Woody Smokehouse. Beautiful uh, in Centerville. They do the best jerky in the world. And they, they come out here in force. They they're tailgate with us. And they tailgate every Houston, Texas game just like we do, supporting our Texans. How many people do you expect to be out there with you guys this it's weekend? It's going to be insane. You're looking at... 400 people, 500 people at our party alone. We'll see, just kind of come through, friends and customers. Wow. Yeah, it's going to be nuts. Well, you know, they say that Houston is the best tailgating city in the country. Yeah. And so you would think that the best tailgating city in the country is going to go crazy. That's right, and they have that best tailgating pits to do it. So we're here to support that and support our teams out there. All right, and tell me, if you don't mind, how much does something like this cost? Because, uh, you know, we try to do it in we, our own way, but this is professional. This is, yeah, this is a little bit over the top. It's got a generator, smoker, grill, griddle. Um, you're looking upwards of 30000 Really? Yes, ma'am. Okay. And no, Custom no. airbrush, everything. Okay, now just for the average guy, though, what do you recommend in terms of uh, 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 the tailgating tomorrow? Um, it's nice to have a mobile kit of some kind. You, you know, the Texans, we do it big, and that's what makes us the best tailgating yes. city in the, in the NFL. And the trailers we do start around 6500 and just kind of move up from there. We have a lot of people that come in and start base and add on to it every year. But you can just, just that backyard grill, just having passion and, and, and doing what you love, getting out there and showing support for your team okay. is most important. All right, George with Pitmaker. We'll come back and talk to you in a, in a few minutes. Don't forget to join us for our special. That's, That's right. That's tonight at 7 o'clock. It's coming up tonight at 7. And just a little hint of what's coming up next in our broadcast. We're going to take you over there to get a look at the recipes that they've come up with to make your tailgating extra special. We'll be right back after this break. Welcome back. We are back out here live with Pitmaker George Shore from Pitmaker. You guys are whipping up some delicious recipes. That's Efren's right. chicken. This is award winning. This is the best chicken popper recipe there is. Uh, won first place 120 team cook off, Umbrody cook off uh, 10 months ago, and it is awesome. Have everything you want in, in tailgate food. And Ephraim has all the information that you need to know about how to make this in your home. We have that online at KHOU.com. We'll have that a little bit later this morning. And, yeah, so it looks delicious. It smells delicious, which is great. We have quite the party out here. And, hey, look who's here. David when Paul. I saw that recipe right here, I had to come out and get a bite of it. That is fantastic. Okay, I got to sample some now fantabuloso. too. Fantabuloso. That looks great. It's to die for. Fantabulous. It's that little jalapeno. That is delicious. Oh, that kicks it the off. Secret. Oh, man. The secret is not a lot of love, a lot of bacon, and a lot of cheese. Love, bacon, and cheese. Love, yes, bacon, that, and cheese. They seem to go they're together they're well, all one and the same, basically. So we got a DJ out here as well. And if you're with us earlier, we talked about the custom pit that you saw on TV. You can join Pitmaker at the Texas playoff game today. If you answer our Facebook question today, you go out there tomorrow, get tickets. If you remember the name of the the client. Who we made the custom trailer for, the, the gun, the Texan smoking gun, which, which will be out there tailgating. We mentioned it earlier in the show. This is it right here. If you remember the name of the client, go to our KHOU 11 Facebook page, post it, and those two tickets to tailgate with these guys at the playoff games tomorrow, they're yours. So go to our Facebook page and let us know, and we'll announce the winner a little bit later on. Back over to you guys. Sounds good. And bring some of that love bacon and cheese right back here in the studio for yeah, us. If there's any left I after know. David Paul, he's eating it all. All right. Stop eating. Me. Now let's send it out to Ron and Christine. They are on the patio this morning with Pitmaker. And I can smell the barbecue right here in the studio. I know. And you know how well it tastes, Catherine. Oh, it's fantastic. Yeah, George Short is joining us from Pitmaker. And George, you guys are about to do what? Something very special right now. That's right. We have bacon wrapped quail for the offense back on the field. And we're pulling the brisket out of the smoking gun right now. Tiffany's, Tiffany's got a handle on it. 
And George, we're talking about a lot of food here. There's, right. We want to tell our viewers that you are helping us team up to give away some tailgating tickets, so they need to pay special attention to this segment. Now, so i got to ask a question now. That's right. How much food is required here for your tailgating crowd? Tomorrow we will be cooking 250 pounds of meat. 250 pounds? Oh, yeah. So how many people? Uh, 350, 400 is what yeah. we expect to kind of run through the party over a period of two hours or so. All right, George, what's the secret to your success in this brisket right here? What have you done? First of all, we put it on the right pit and paid it really loving attention to it. And we also put special <laughs> award-winning competition spices and ropes. And, of course, you're going to give us the secret to that right now, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what do, you, what, do you, what do you recommend to the average person who's going to go and tailgate in terms of making brisket? What do you recommend? Um, brisket, well, the, key, the key thing to brisket is having consistent temperature. Um, great rub is important, but consistent temperature and timing is everything for a good competition of brisket. Keep it tender, moist, and not dried out, not tough. You don't it's, a, it's a balance. It. You don't want to overcook it. That's correct. And right. I think that one's cooked really well. You can see the smoke ring, uh, how juicy it is, tender, everything. It's got everything. Okay. And is We've, there like one big thing that uh, that a lot of people make as a mistake? Uh, oh, that's okay. Three second rule. Three <laughs> yes. second rule. Okay. <laughs> Who's uh, going? What's the biggest mistake to avoid when you're tailgating? Um, don't drop the food. Don't drop <laughs> the food. <laughs> you can't try to go to the grocery store when you have uh, 20,000 people in the parking lot around you. I've got to ask you though. You've got a lot of food here. Which one is your favorite? I'm pretty partial to those first down chicken poppers. Yeah, uh, they're Brisket. awesome. All That's right what on. David Paul was bragging about. He was <laughs> salivating right. when he came here. in the studio. All right, George, thank you so much. And remember, viewers, there were a couple questions in there that you want to hang on to the answers for. We're going to have more on that and how you can win a prepared tailgating ticket exactly. coming up. Exactly, and don't forget uh, tonight to tune in at 7 o'clock. We've got our big Texan special. Yeah. We're going behind the scenes in the stadium. We're talking to cheerleaders, the players, to get you prime for tomorrow's game. We'll be right back after this break. We got to eat. I'm happy yes. about that. I'm happy about the food that's out there, too. Catherine is standing by with the Pitmaker crew. That's right. We're getting all fired up for the big Texans game and Texans victory over the Bengals tomorrow. That's, that's what right. we are hoping for. George Shore is here from Pitmaker. We have quite the party out here this morning. Oh, yeah. In honor of kicking those Bengals in their butt tomorrow, we're going to brand some Bengal back ribs for you. Yeah, we got some Texan Bengal themed dishes here today. We talked about right. the brisket earlier, the chicken, and now we're moving on to ribs as well. That's right. And you might hear the music in the background, have a DJ as well. That's right. We have awesome Crazy Legs Cantu. Uh, he's a VJ DJ. He's got control of these TVs. He's thrown out the videos and the tunes, and he brings a lot to the party. And the reason that we are showing all this to you this morning is because you can join these guys tomorrow. If you paid attention earlier, we mentioned how many pounds of beef you all are cooking up tomorrow for That's your tailgate right. party at Reliant. And if you know the number, go to our KHOU 11 Facebook page, be the first one to post it, and two tailgating tickets are yours. So, very exciting time. Oh, yeah, best tailgating party at the stadium. Guarantee it. Definitely. And all the recipes we showed you as well, those are going to be online too. But we want to go ahead, if we can, and brand some of the meat. So, oh, yeah. yeah, we'll talk about that. And do you have any secrets for the ribs? And again, what are these ribs called? Bengal back. Ribs. <laughs> Bingle back ribs. So yes. Cincinnati Bengals, they are gonna, definitely going to get grilled. That's right. We're going to eat the stripes off the ribs. That's right. So let's go ahead and take a look right here. We have, again, we have the recipes online, and there they are. Those look like they're full of flavor. Yes. Spicy, sweet. Got the smoke in them. Got the char. And uh, Catherine is going to do the honors here and okay. brand those stripes right We're on We're going to brand the stripes right on them. Whoa, here it sizzle. <laughs> so we hope you all join the party tomorrow. And of course, we also have our KHOU Texan special later on this evening at 7 o'clock. So a big, big party. And there's more to come out here. George, thanks so much for being here. It's our pleasure always, Catherine. We appreciate it. And go Texans. Back over to you guys. She said it.
Yeah, go Texans. And let's save us some of those Bengal, Bengal, Bengal back ribs. Or whatever yeah. they're called. <laughs> have a great day. And thanks to all the viewers who have watched me over the years. I've actually, um, today's my final day. I'm going to be moving on to San Diego and anchoring there. So I want to say goodbye and thanks to everybody for their support. And, and all the behind the, the scenes folks that never get all the attention they deserve. Thanks to our producers and so many people. They have been just fantastic to me while I've been here in Houston. So thank you. And we made you some brisket on your last yes, day. Yes, my final Back meal. Back here. Let's give her some brisket. Let's have some brisket. Let's go. There's some brisket. Again, pit maker, award winning. What do we have right here? Quail bites. Quail bites. Oh, how about some quail? Ooh, I got to have some. All right. I'm going to take a piece. What's it taste like? Good. Chicken. Now this brisket, Ooh, this tell, is good. tell her what it's marinated in. What's it marinated in? Tiger blood. Tiger blood. Tiger blood. Tiger blood. Bengals are going Big down. Tiger Texas blood. number one. Yeah. Tiger right. blood. Yeah, that's right. Right. Tiger blood Ooh. up. Ooh. Winning. Go will be winning. Have a great day.